is our week, and we knew it. And you got it done against a good opponent. It wasn't easy. And those are the special ones. I want you to enjoy this. Because everybody else is in trouble from here on out. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, D. How about the coaches right there? Yeah. Yeah. You talked yeah. about yeah. believing in each other, and you did it. It was a team effort. Yeah. I want you to enjoy this one, boys. Yeah. Super D. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Out of bounds at the 18. Place, kick up, kick good. And Auburn has the lead, nine to seven with 5.14 to go. They need the 48, third down and three. Etling wants to throw, looking left all the way. Pass is caught, short of the first down. Hit immediately, a pair of 15s, Joshua Holsey. Ryan Davis in motion, they'll fake it to him on the sweep. White down the field, carry on Johnson 40, carry on Johnson 50, and shoved out of bounds inside LSU territory at the 41 yard line. One half in the books and, and you could tell after two quarters what kind of game yeah. this was going to be. Looking back, coming into the game, talk about the week of preparation, the focus, yeah. and then the plan coming in. You, you know, I told our guys in the locker room after Texas A&M that this is going to be one of those defining weeks for the rest of the season. And uh, our leadership really stepped up. They had a great week of practice. They were focused. They put the loss behind them. Uh, our coaches did an outstanding job of doing the same thing. And uh, we just had a peace. We just felt like this was going to be our night. And, uh, you know, I think our players felt that. And, they found a way to win at the end, and that's what we talked about. It's probably going to be a close game, guys. We'll find a way to win. They believed in each other, and it was good, good, good victory. You know, there's some games where you go in and you have a lot of a fourth and shorts, and you may yeah. go for it. But tonight, it was the kind yeah. of game where you knew you better take some points. Yeah, right? yeah. I knew our defense was playing well, and uh, just felt like you know we needed to kick those field goals. We got the best field goal kicker in college football, and Daniel's just uh, a huge weapon. He made pressure kick after pressure kick. He kicked every one in the end zone on the. On the, uh, they were all touchbacks on uh, kicking off, and he's a huge weapon. Offensively, talk about the night Sean White had yeah. for you. I thought he managed things very well. You know, Sean White starting to come into his own. I really felt like he was in control of the offense. Uh, just did a good job. Uh, we didn't have any interceptions. Uh, we didn't have as many negative plays. And I thought he did a good job on third down. You, know, we were almost 50 percent against that bunch, and that's really something. Late in that first half. I thought you saw their defensive line start to yeah. tire a little bit. Yeah, they sure did. You know, I think we were running about five yards a shot on the inside zone. Our offensive line was getting a push and got down to about the one yard yeah. line and we were about to push <laughs> push it in and then they had a, an injury yeah. and then they stuffed us right there. But I thought our offensive line did a good job. All right, <laughs> Tigers lead at halftime. When we come back a little bit later on, we'll take a look at second half highlights. Stay tuned. You're watching the Auburn Football Review presented by Toyota. The Auburn Football Review is presented by Toyota, visit your local Toyota dealer today. Toyota, let's go places. And by the Better Network, Verizon, better matters. I come slowly, slowly, slowly getting faster. Once I start in counting, it's very hot. Baby, I'm 90% sure the card's moving. It is so exciting. I took up forever. Count until I drop. Lisa 2016 RAV4 XLE for $209 a month for 36 months. Toyota, let's go places. I'm John Merrill. As your Secretary of State, I want to ensure that every eligible U.S. citizen that's a resident of Alabama is registered to vote and has a qualified government-issued photo ID. You can register to vote by downloading our app for your iPhone or your Android, or you can visit alabamavotes.gov. We want you to be registered to vote and have a photo ID. You can make a difference. We'll see you at the poll. An Auburn University education emphasizes hard work, that training becomes wisdom, and that you can only count on what you earn. Auburn graduates believe in honesty, a spirit that is not afraid, and preparedness, because one never knows when cause for celebration will arrive. This is Auburn. And we're back on the Auburn Football Review presented by Toyota. Auburn a winner over LSU 18-13. It's time now for our academic spotlight. And this week it's quarterback Sean White. 
Uh, he's pretty good on the field. He's pretty good in the classroom, too. Yeah, he really is. He's maturing uh, in both areas. Sean White, Academic Spotlight. The Academic Spotlight is brought to you by Hyundai, proud sponsor of college football and loyal fans everywhere. I want to get into business one day, so I want to learn how the money's made, and uh, I think finance is a great way to do that. Financial accounting is pretty tough. That's a tough class, and business calculus are probably the toughest ones that I've had to take. Those are tough, but they, I mean, they, they're, uh, they got some good stuff, and I think it's made me a better student. I uh, teach business law in the College of Business, and uh, there are large classes, 200 plus students per class, and Sean was in um, one of my business law classes uh, last fall. Economics, both the economic classes, microeconomics and macroeconomics, were really interesting to me because I think that they're practical for what I'm going to try to get into, not just learning you know, cool stuff for the class, but really for, for the field that I'm entering. I'd like to own a business one day. I mean, I, I, I don't know, right after football, right when I get out, I'd like to just uh, gain some experience and probably get in a bigger company in the financial uh, section. I mean, they go hand in hand as far as work ethic goes and time management, stuff like that, in order to succeed in one um, or either of them. You gotta be able to manage your time well and you can't cut corners in either of them. So um, just work hard and, and, uh, and learn your stuff. You know, for football, whether it's learning the defense, for uh, academics, it's learning, you know, studying for the test, it's, it's about the same. To be successful in that class, uh, it's a maximum of independent study. There aren't a whole lot of day-to-day -day assignments other than reading um, the material and that. Quite frankly, a lot of students get lost in that class. But the, um, the good students in there, and Sean was one of my better students, the good students work hard and they work well on their own without a whole lot of background. And it's the type of class you can't really do well unless you put uh, effort into it. Yeah, I mean, it's just most of the time management. You can't, when you go in your room, you can't play video games and, or watching TV, watching SpongeBob or something. You gotta be doing your stuff. Somebody told me one time that, out of, you know, whether your social life, academics, or football, you usually can only be good at two out of the three. You know, so football and academics are the most important, so those are the two out of three I try to be the best at. The Auburn Football Review is presented by Blue Cross Blue Shield of Alabama. We cover what matters. And by Great Southern Wood, Yellowwood brand pressure treated pine. If it doesn't have this yellow tag, you don't want it. I'm Jamie Foxx for Verizon. In the nation's largest independent study by Root Metrics, again, Verizon is the number one network. Hi, I'm Jamie Foxx for Sprint. And I'm Jamie Foxx for T Mobile. And, and we're, we're just, just as good. good. Really? Only Verizon was ranked number one nationally in data, reliability, text, and call, and speed. Yeah. And you're gonna fist pump today? Don't get limited by an unlimited plan. Switch now and get our best deal. 20 gigs of limitless data for just 160 with four lines. All on America's best network. Good or better? The Hyundai Tucson versus the Ford Escape. Estimated fueling costs? The Ford's higher. Whoa. Estimated routine repairs? The Ford's higher. What's happening? In fact, Guys? Hyundai has the lowest five-year cost to own of all brands for 2016. So again, Ford's higher. Guys? That's really high. Very funny! Ha <laughs> ha! Better is the reason to buy Hyundai. The 2016 Tucson from Hyundai. America, it's time. Time to break free from the confines of your couch. To tear yourself away from the tyranny of technology to revolt against a social revolution that's anything but social. It's time to embrace the possibilities right outside your door. It's time to build your declaration of independence. Sophie, his 13th birthday. Gift, we've got you. Guitar, coming tomorrow. Road game today, surprise party tomorrow. Uh, change of plans. Game tomorrow. No, birthday tomorrow. Hotel, hotel. Guitar. Reroute. Birthdays are on birthdays. Party. Relocate. UPS My Choice makes rerouting packages easy. Wow. How we're helping companies solve for the needs of customers like Sophie. Gives it to Fournette, nowhere to go. In fact, he lost a couple. 
Montrevious Adams got in there and blew that play up. Etling all alone back there, takes the snap. Steps up, wants to run, he can't go. Dropped, Marlon Davidson, the freshman. Marcus Davidson motion right to left. Sean White fires, pass, caught. Oh, what a dandy catch by Kyle Davis. And that will move the chains as he's out to the 42-yard line. He had a defender draped all over him. Mike Powell ready to snap it back to Stovall. There it is, puts it down, kick is up. Carlson up and good. No, oh, the ball is dropped, mishandled. It's on the ground. Matt scrambled for it at the 31. Auburn says they have it. They do. There's the turnover. There's the turnover Auburn needed. Empty backfield. Now carry on Johnson moves into the backfield. Second and four. Carry on gets the carry. Left side breaks a tackle. Has his first down. He'll carry a defender down to the 20 yard line. This will be a 29 yard attempt for Carlson. Snap, place, kick is up, kick is good. He's perfect, six for six tonight. 18-13, Auburn on top. Etling in the shotgun. Throws it deep, downfield. Knocking it away beautifully. Carlton Davis, what a job. Etling with protection in the backfield from Fournette. Over the middle to Fournette, and Trey Matthews right there. Fournette to the left of Etling. Takes the snap, pressure off the edge, Lawson, he's got him! Down he goes at the 20 yard line! There's Mr. Lawson, fervently so! A final reversal! Auburn 18, LSU 13. We had to wait for it. We knew we were right. Auburn knew that they were right. So Auburn wins in thrilling fashion, just a Another chapter in this very oddball rivalry between Auburn and LSU with, with the way the game ended. And Auburn wins it by a final score of 18 to 13. Uh, I don't know what it is about this series, but it's the, it has some odd finishes, odd things that happened. Uh, but late in that game, there was a big overturn, and correctly so. What were yeah. you seeing from the sideline over there, Coach? Yeah, well, I knew there was one second. I knew they were winding the clock. Mm -hmm. And sure enough, it went zero. The ball hadn't been snapped. and. You know, they let it play, but but I knew it was uh, zero. I just knew it was a matter of time going to the booth, and I was just hoping that they would make the correct call. Carry on Johnson, 161 <clears throat> yards of total offense. Yeah. We laughed about it in the booth with our new sideline with our, our new sideline reporter Ronnie Brown. That was a Ronnie Brown kind of ball game. Yeah, I tell you what, Carrion's got a chance to be a real special player. He's a great person, and you know, I think him and Cameron Petway they really complement each other too. And uh, he really carried the load in the second half. Talk more about the defense now, Coach. And yeah. in the in the second half, they had to step up. Carl Lawson with yeah. a big sack, but I mean he was. He was not the only one. Talk yeah. about your defensive plan. Coming well, in. I thought our defense did a good job. You know, number seven gave it, got the best of us last year. We made his highlight reel for his Heisman run, and and uh, he didn't have any touchdowns. And uh, he's a very good running back. We gang tackled him. I thought our linebackers did a solid job. We played a lot of them. We lost Trey Williams, you know, and we had some young guys step up. Never, <clears throat> with Fournette, never gave up that back-breaking run. Yeah. You never let him just get yeah. loose. Yeah, that, that was big. And, you know, he gets the second level, he's really scary. And we had some good open field tackles on him, and I thought that was the difference in the game. Auburn wins an 18-13 over LSU. We'll be back on the Auburn Football Review, presented by Toyota. The Auburn Football Review is presented by Toyota. Visit your local Toyota dealer today. Toyota, let's go places. And by the Better Network. Verizon, better matters. America, it's time. Time to break free from the confines of your couch. To tear yourself away from the tyranny of technology. To revolt against a social revolution that's anything but social. It's time to embrace the possibilities right outside your door. It's time to build your declaration of independence. Americans don't celebrate the good enough canyon. We didn't aim to be second to the moon. Verizon doesn't settle for good enough either. So now we are introducing Verizon LTE Advanced. With 50% faster peak speeds in more than 450 cities coast to coast. So don't settle for an unlimited plan with limits. Switch now and get our best deal. 20 gigs of limitless data with four lines for only $160. Welcome to the next gen network.
2016 Nissan Altima. An IIHS Top Safety Pick Plus. With forward emergency braking that could stop for you. Take on sudden stops. Get to your local Nissan store today for 0% financing for up to 72 months. Or save up to 4500 on the 2016 Altima. Get to Nissan, a proud partner of the Auburn Tigers. Time for another episode of Kicking It with Kevin. Welcome to another Kicking It with Kevin. I'm here with Tucker Brown. Tucker, where are you from? I'm from Trustwell, Alabama. How far away is that? Uh, it's about two hours, right up 280. Did you kind of grow up an Auburn fan? Uh, I've been bleeding orange and blue since I came out of the womb. Well, okay then. All right. So, what's your favorite part about Auburn? Uh, just the atmosphere. Regardless of if you're on the sidelines or in the stands, everyone's just, it's so loud and crazy. I just love that all the football has been a part of me for a long time. For sure. So what's your favorite tradition? Uh, it's nothing beats Tiger Walk. Uh, back when I was, I don't know, like five or six years ago, I was a young kid and Alabama played here and Tiger Walk was at night because after daylight savings time, it was one of the craziest things I've ever been a part of. If, if you found a picture of yourself in a dictionary, what word would it be under? Goofy. Now, can you define it? Uh, can't stop laughing. <laughs> always looking to prank someone. Always looking to goof off and not really take much stuff serious. And it's, when it gets serious, you usually walk out of the room. Good deal. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would it be? Oh shoot, I'd love to go to, I'd love to see Antarctica. You heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for kicking it with Kevin. We'll see you next week. See you next week. It's now time for the top five plays of the week. Presented by Nissan, proud supporter of college athletics. Shop ChooseNissan.com, innovation that excites. Number five. And they'll give it to Fournette. He's going back for a loss. Auburn could see that one coming. Montrevious Adams, Daryl Williams in the backfield to greet Leonard Fournette, who didn't get back to uh, maybe the 18-yard line. Number four. Etling in the shotgun. Throws it deep, downfield. Knocking it away beautifully. Carlton Davis, what a job. Trayvon Doral, the intended receiver. And Carlton Davis, you couldn't play it any more perfect. That's the way a cover corner plays the ball. Number three. White looks right. Dumps it off left. Carry on. Johnson's got a lot of running room. He picks up the first down. He missed, makes a man miss. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 30 yard line. Carry on. Johnson battling. Thomas finally got him out. But what a run after the catch to get the first down. Number two. Tyler Stovall will hold it out of the snap of Ike Powell. Stovall puts it down. Carlson kicks it up. Line drive. Bingo! Another long one for Daniel Carlson. This one 51 yards and Auburn leads three to nothing. I tell you what, I'm glad he's on our team. That is for sure. And your number one play of the week. Takes the snap, pressure off the edge, Lawson. He's got him. Down he goes at the 20 yard line. There's Mr. Lawson coming in when we needed him the most. On the back side, speed rush just gets off the snap and comes up with a huge sack at the 20 yard line, third down and long. The Auburn Football Review is presented by Blue Cross Blue Shield of Alabama. We cover what matters. And by Great Southern Wood, Yellowwood brand pressure treated pine. If it doesn't have this yellow tag, you don't want it.
2016 Nissan Altima. An IIHS Top Safety Pick Plus. With forward emergency braking that could stop for you. Take on sudden stops. Get to your local Nissan store today for 0% financing for up to 72 months or save up to $4,500 on the 2016 Altima. Get to Nissan, a proud partner of the Auburn Tigers. An Auburn University education emphasizes hard work. That training becomes wisdom. And that you can only count on what you earn. Auburn graduates believe in honesty, a spirit that is not afraid, and preparedness. Because one never knows when cause for celebration will arrive. This is Auburn. Welcome back into our final segment here on the Auburn Football Review, presented by Toyota. Auburn wins it 18 to 13, and, and now you turn the page. I don't know if I, I might need to get in line for the cold tub on Sunday, Coach, because it felt like up in the booth this, <laughs> we played a physical game against LSU. But now you look ahead to another Louisiana team. Louisiana Monroe comes in, homecoming, a chance to continue to get better. Yeah, homecoming, got another home game, our fifth, fifth in a row. I know that's been great for our players. Our fans were off the charts tonight. I mean, I can't say enough about our fans. Our student section was unbelievable. They really helped us late in that game, and uh, real happy we got another home game. A lot of great emotion at the end of this one as well with the team celebrating with the student section. It was very fun to see, and, and certainly uh, a win well-deserved for this Auburn football team. 18-13 the final. ULM comes to town next Saturday afternoon. 2.30 kick airtime on the Auburn Sports Network is at 12.30. We'll see you back here next week on the Auburn Football Review, presented by Toyota. <laughs>